Hello everyone. Welcome back to uh, Komodo Brownie. This time playing Dragon Quest Builders 2, which uh, I had a poll and about three people voted for it. It won the poll, so I'll play this one, f like I guess first. And uh, I was I have been playing Diab like two seconds of Diablo 3 on my own. Um. We're currently in a loading screen. Uh... <laughs> Demo. Let's see if there's any demo data. I didn't see any. I might have deleted it. Because it was way back then. Hmm. Guess I have some demo data. Probably should have started from the beginning. Wow, these loading t screen time. I can't really, I don't have the internet to uh, download any updates, so. Well. Hockey awakens on a sandy shore. Seems she has washed up on a desert island along with the wreckage of the skeleton ship. She decides to take a look around to see what she can see. Well, um, see. um. Miscellaneous quit. Yes. We're going to start from the beginning because I am. It will be deleted after you start a new game. Are you sure you want to start? Yeah. If you delete this save day, it'll be lost for good. Yeah. Time to design your character. Goral. Goral. Um, hair. Oh, looks good. Skin. Skin. Eyes. Purple. No, oh, hold on. Uh, no. Um. They all look the same. Is this it? Is that all, all I can do? Uh, okay. Enter name. Uh. KB it is. Good enough. You can now adjust the game settings. Once you're happy, select Confirm. Okay. Um, 
type 2 or type 3 diabetes, I'm good with type 1. I'm good with what's... what's featured. Good enough. I think these will be this will be okay for now. Let me pull my laptop closer to me. Uh oh. There went my uh capture box okay not a big fan of VCA VC face compared to like uh, V up rip V up I was never going to pay for you loading how slow Oh. Any day now. Oh, I just realized you can hear the creaks in my chair. I think they're getting picked up by the audio. I, there, at least I have a chair, I guess. I should probably get like an ergonomic like office chair. Something that's good for my back. <sighs> I've almost forgot what I was doing. I'm playing a game. A game. A video game. Remember, y'all asked for this. Oh. I do like Dragon Quest, and this game was kind of on sale on GameStop. Like, I got it, like, a bundle of them, of games. Um, I don't have a capture card for 3DS, or I guess I could play, like, other Pokemon games. Just so much, it would be kind of easy, I guess, compared to, like, downloading software and then downloading the game uh, stuff for uh, 3DS. Because I'm lazy. Very lazy. Like, if there's voices for this, I'm not speaking. Like, at all.
at the time of uh, recording this, it's almost time for uh, the Polywag Community Day, but in Oklahoma, where I live, it's like 100 to 103 degrees, so I am not going to, like, go out and do mu like much, like, participation, like, if any at all. Like, I might look for some shiny Polywags, but, uh... I'm not going outside to get some, like, Pokeballs and stuff because I'm good. Uh. But, uh, uh, what does the shiny polywag look like? I don't know. I'd have to look it up. I know, like, the polygrath was, like, green um maybe i think maybe maybe poly world not poly world uh poly toad is like uh a lighter green maybe barely any difference but shiny pokemon are nice because they sparkle i participate in the uh Squirtle one, and I got a, a, um, Blastoise, a shiny Blastoise with, a Hydro Pump. Okay, loading screen. Please load. Please. It's like, ten minutes of, like, no gameplay. Like, whoops. My bad. I'm I'm right now I'm like feeling for like a schedule of when I can record videos because uh my grandparents need a lot of help and maybe Sundays is can be good as long as my grandpa won't need me for anything like uh I don't know he might be he might just teach me how to mow the lawn Cause my sister, she can do everything. She can clean, she can cook, she can mow the lawn. Uh, she can raise wildlife for some reason. Um, meanwhile, I'm just like, I can play video games. And I can draw itty bit. Yeah, there's like a huge disparity in our values here. Um, also, I can keep chickens alive. Um, not much else. Not much else I can do because uh, that's work. You don't make me do work. Oh, man, gee. Although, actually, I was, like, Thursday, I, or last Thursday, I was, uh, doing laundry. My grandma was like, sit down, sit down, you're working so hard. And it's like, I'm not doing anything. I'm just washing loads of laundry. And we have to keep the, like, loads really small because, uh, uh, my grandma's, uh, washing machine when it gets unbalanced it just like starts throwing everything just th starts throwing mad fits until you like rebalance and just sometimes you just can't rebalance it um but I, I so you just just one set of sheets at a time I still have to put my aunt uh she uh was helping with uh watching my grandma and uh she, uh, put, t didn't, blah, blah, blah. Her, uh, she just finally, uh, took her sheets off. I have to find a, an appropriate pair. It's really hard because, uh, all the pillowcases do not match anybody. Like, uh, my grandma was using a, a pair of that, uh, uh, that belongs to her bed on uh, 
my aunt and uncle's bed. And I'm like, I was getting the sheets, uh, changing them when before uh, my uncle arrived to like watch my help watch my uh, grandpa and grandma. And uh, I was thinking, dang, these sheets look familiar, just like the ones my uh, grandma and I got off her bed. Or not sheets, these uh, pillowcases. Uh, am I really playing a game? Or am I just suffering? Just sitting here. Waiting for the game to play. Uh... Do 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 I hope I don't get like some random copyright strike because I don't even know what I hum or sing half the time. Uh Um, did people, did, like, streamers and, like, uh, oh, I forgot that when I plug in my phone to the PC, it just decides to, like, go, hey, it brings up, like, this different, like, huge window, and it's like, I don't, didn't ask for this. What have I done? Anyways... Do, like, streamers, when, like, the f game first came out, have, like, this problem? Or do they patch it before it came out? Because uh, we're going 20 minutes of, like, no gameplay. Hmm. What is Monster Hunter Stories? Window capture. Which is the one that I used to uh, do mobile? Huh. I wonder if I have to log in to, uh, see, um, mirror, wonder share mirror go.
Hmm. Okay, that's locked, so I have to unlock that. Um, copy and paste. I think I can do a whole body for this. Um, VC face. Um, let's see. No, don't want to grab that. Want to grab this. What's that other one? Um... There we go. It's all kind of looking, kind of dumb looking ish, but let me turn on my GPS. Oh, look. It's polywag. Not shiny. Not shiny. Not shiny. Oh, shiny. I can't aim worth beans. Caught a polywag. It's okay, I guess. Not shiny. Not shiny. Not shiny. But it will give me candy. Not shiny. Oh, barely missed that one, though. Like, oh my gosh. Uh, missed it anyway. <sighs> Can't eat them for beans. Whoops. But I got it. Oh, I caught five? Okay. Um...
today. Use five berries to help catch Pokemon. Catch five Poliwag. Make not five nice throws. I need friends. Okay. Whoops. Damn it. Well, that's a nice throw. I need Pokeballs. I don't need these King Rocks. I need Pokeballs. Stupid game. Okay. Poop. Poop. How are we on the new Nintendo Switch? Still loading. Um. I'm going to transfer this one. Okay. Crooked. Crooked to throws, of course. But it stayed. Transferring. Okay, I got the great throw. You. Oh well. Hold on. Crap, I missed. Oh, I got it somehow. Okay. And I got it. Transfer. Gosh, I got a lot of candies for this. Um, shindig. Mm. I'm good. I'm good. I don't really have too much in like the uh, many long years, several years I've played because I just don't have internet or I don't have like service down where I live, like self-service. And I'm not going to town just to walk around or drive around. Um. Okay. What should I name this? What should I name this? No, no, no. I don't have a good polywhirl or wag. Hmm. No hideouts. That's okay, I don't care. Oh, Reggie Drago. I'm good. Um. There's nothing else. Still loading. Okay. <sighs> We oui. 
we got a little ape. Oh, that's six. That's double the candies for like everywhere. Oh, there's a polywag. Not shiny. But it got a nice throw. But I didn't use berries. They're a bit small. Oh good, nice throws count for y'all too. But I forgot to use berries. Oh, it's a small baby. Now, no Pokemon. Rip. Um, I did play a little bit yesterday, and, uh, that was enough. Because it was, like, almost, like, 90 degrees, and I went out with, like, just to walk around town a little bit, make a little walk around town without any preparation, like, water. Water. No water. Wee. Full. Oops, I'm full. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I can probably send some Pokemon to, uh, Let me check on it to let's go. Still loading. Okay, let's just go past scroll past the Gen One Pokemon. Um I got this shiny Pokemon, and then I'm like, oh, cool, it's shiny. <laughs> and then it's like, IVs are, IVs are a little shit. It's like, why do you bother living? Oh, that's right, because you're shiny. That's why. Okay, now we're in the uh, Gen 2 zone. Actually, I can send some Pokemon... Uh, Um, over to home settings, um, connected devices and services, home. Should I be showing that support idea? Should I blur that out? Anyway, let's go past the uh, Gen 1 into Gen 2. Um, this circ Sunkern, we can send that. Because that is a Gen 1 Pokemon. Send a Smeargle, or two. Um. Ah, uh, the Seadot stuck. I think the Seadot was okay. Um. Send a Bidoof. And... This shield on. Uh, neither of the tyrants are, are any, really any good. Uh, so I'll send this one, and then everybody's a favorite. Um, yeah, everybody's either favorited or a shadow Pokemon. I'm kind of tired. Kind of too lazy, actually. Um, to purify, 
These polywags. Oh, right. I, I didn't because I could just send them to Pokemon Go. Duh. Um... This will lighten my load by a wee bit. Um, I'll send these. I only have to wait an hour. Nothing else. And... Still loading. Hold on. Oh. Well, I mean, oh, yeah. Okay, I guess. I just had to reactivate and deactivate it. My bad. Our unholy father... Ben gave up his mortal form so that Malroth, the master of destruction, might be reborn and the world be consumed by catastrophe. Alas, mighty Malroth was defeated at the hands of this despicable spawn of Erdrick before Hargon's glorious vision could be brought to life. I probably missed something. The moon has waxed and waned many times since that fateful day. Now peace reigns supreme and our order has been scattered to the four corners of the earth. Tell me, brothers and sisters, what does a monster do when backed into a corner? It bites, I say. We must do everything and anything within our power to bring this world to ruin. Huzzah, huzzah, all hail Hargon. Praise be to Malroth. O oh, hellish father, hear our prayer. Deliver us from this world of oblivion. Lead us ever onwards as we build our dominion of darkness together. Dragon Quest Builders 2. Komodo Brownie is an idiot. KB. You are the hero who will save this world. Arise, my child. Your destiny awaits. Kekehe. The look on your face. I was only ribbing you, my child. You're no hero. I know that much. You're one of them builders, right? Yeah, I guess. Kehehe. You want to watch that mouth of yours, girl? Telling the truth might land you with more than you bargained for. Still, at least you're not a master builder. Uh, you might only be an apprentice, but that'll do. I've actually got to got just the job for a lass like you. Once you've wiped the sleep from your sockets, come and meet me up on the deck. Okay. Uh, use left to move your character and. Uh, right to a controller at the camera. Press B to jump. Oh, good. Open. Hello. Builder. Builder, I have something to tell you. Did you know that you can run by holding R while you move around with L? I'm sure the extra speed will come in handy, but take care in your high ledges or you'll meet your maker sooner rather than later. Okay. Ah, uh, the builder. Tell me, girl, do the children of Hargon frighten you? Do you wish to flee from this floating coffin? These waters are cursed. Strange voices carry across the waves, and many a vessel has vanished into vapor. The crew victims to an unknown fate. Now are you scared? Not as scared as I am, I assure you. I'll be off to this death trap at the first opportunity. Okay. Um. A slime. 
This is where we stow our cargo. Real sim real slime mariners like me called it call it the hold. Say, you wouldn't be that apprentice builder I've been hearing about, would you? They sure can make all sorts of stuff from just a few bits and blobs. I don't know how you builders do it. As the magnificent Harloon said, just has said, destructive away way of all that is built. To think of all to think of all that hard work going to waste. We bump bump. Okay. Okay. How nice of me to like close the door behind me as I open it. Stairs are no match for you, I see. <laughs> you just can't keep a good girl down. Kick a kick. Now as as you'll no doubt have spotted, we're sailing the open ocean. You've got no chance of escaping, so don't even bother trying. Not that you'd get very far anyway. You're nothing but skin and bones. Here, get this down your gullet. It's fresh from the captain's table, which is where I sit, by the way. Kehe. <laughs> Piece of kelp. Can't remember why she last ate. The thought of food makes her stomach start rumbling. Believe it or not, the kelp can be uh, eaten. Select it with control and press X to eat it. Doing so will fill your coldness cage and uh, replenish some hearts. Okay. Better eat that seaweed before. Select it with. Okay. Pressing X is very hard. Down in one, that kelp's pretty tasty, isn't it? The pundit aroma and slimy texture make for a spine tingling combo. You should thank your lucky star that you got a scoff of a scoff is so, such a scrumptious snack because it'll be the last meal you ever eat. Yep, you heard me right, you'll be dead soon enough. But don't worry, you won't be shuffling off this mortal coil just yet. I've got plenty of hard graft for you to be getting on with first. Uh I'm gonna take like a break after dealing with that. Um, okay, I'm back. I'm recording, uh, currently. Okay, I took a little several hour break. It is now 10 o'clock. Um, my Pokemon sleep uh, has me at like a bedtime of like 10.30 maybe? Maybe 11.30, I don't know. Anyways, that's not important right now. Uh, I also, like I took a several hour break, <laughs> but I uh, watched, like ate food, watched some NCIS, drank some water. I am much better. I can play until I reach a better stopping point. Hehehe, <laughs> you can wipe that lily-livered look off your face. I'm not going to send you to the cemetery anytime soon. So long as you've got some life left in you, I'll give you a chance to keep hold of it. But you'll have to follow my orders to the letter. What's that? You want to know uh, who you are and why, what you're doing here? If you're that desperate to find out how far up the creek you are without a paddle, I might add, go and talk to the five monsters beneath the flag over there. Okay, cool. Um, er, the ship keeps swaying the side to side. I feel a bit seasick. What's that? You want to know where, where we're sailing to? I haven't the foggiest. The higher ups would never tell stuff like that to a lowly little Draki. Ah, uh, that's my monster. Hello, Gooman. Slurp. We're the hot last surviving members of the Children of Haragoon, the ones who didn't get squished. Uh, we're going, we're gooing to bring up this world to its needs in the name of the good rate and good glorious high priest. Yep. What's with all the slurping? I'm just saliv salivating at the prospect of squashing you goomans once and for all. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Okay, that's one more. Well, if it isn't the little myth builder, we're only an apprentice, but you're prancing around like you own the place. 
honestly, you can't go anywhere where these days without bumping into an install little build or hell bent on on doing all of our hard work. The world's going down the pan, that's for sure. Our only uh, choice is to eliminate bothersome builders like you one by one. <laughs> Do you talk with a lisp, sir? You're that. You also talk with a lisp. Okay. You're that apprentice builder that nab nabbed in uh, Cantlin, aren't you? I must admit, I feel up. I feel a few pangs of sympathy for you. It's not very nice to know that your end is nigh. <laughs> okay, and one more. Middenhall, Cannock, Brun. Moonbrook from forth these three kingdoms become the hated heroes, the scions of Erdrick and laid all mighty Hargon low. I have not played uh, Dragon Quest 3. I should probably do that. I think I played a little bit of one on a ROM once. I couldn't really like, I didn't beat it though. I got stuck on finding a stairs. I, s I suck at stairs. And finding things. Oh god, finding stairs, like, in... There's, like, this... In, uh... What's the... Like, I, I will... There's this, uh, finding stairs in, uh... The, for the last temple in, uh, what's the game? I forget. I know what it is. Oh, Spirit Tracks. Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. Never, never made it. Never found the last, like, the stairs. I could never find it. Like, the tiles were just so... Eh. And, but, uh... My brother managed to beat the game, I think. Or he at least made managed to beat the, uh... Last temple, the sand temple, or whatever. But, yeah. Finding, like, stairs on a specific plot and missing them all just sucks. Anyways. Uh, from forth these three kingdoms to become the hated heroes, the signs of Erdrick and laid ha almighty heart on low. With his dying breath, our exalted leader surrendered his mortal form so that Malroth, the lord of destruction, could be born. Alas, he too was vanquished. But does that mean all hope is lost? No, I say. Argon's ambitions did not perish with him. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but one day we will reduce this world to ruin. Okay. So I got kidnapped by a cult of monsters. Kehehe, <laughs> so you talked to the rest of the crew. Eh, obedient little blighter, aren't you? So now you know we're the last survivors of the children of Hargon, loyal servants of the mighty master of destruction himself. That means you builders are our sworn enemies. We're still, we're sailing the ocean blue, rounding up pesky vermin like you, along with anyone else who gets in our way. And you want to know what uh, we're going to do with all of these builders? Only the higher ups know for sure, but I'll make no bones about it. I reckon you lot are up for the job. Still, that doesn't mean we can't make the most of what little time you've got left. Just be thankful you can be of some benefit as your final moments draw even closer. Complete. Okay, what else? Listen up, Builder. Unless you want to spend the rest of your life behind bars, or worse, you'll do as I say. So here's the deal. Last night's storm messed up my ship good and proper. I want you to make the make things ship right, ship shape around here again. To start with, I want you to break up all the driftwood strewn about the deck and bring them. Bring me the wood when you're done. Go on, chop chop. Okay. Um, each piece of driftwood is marked with a I with an icon. Run up and press Y so that, to punch it into something useful. Uh, there we go. Okay. More. Um, or is there any up here? Nope, no driftwood got up here. Yeah. 
punch. Punch. No punch. Nope, no punching barrel. Well, well, my deck looks much better in shape now that you picked up the, all that wood. No flies on you, eh? Still, I suppose being given the chance to uh, save your scar sorry skin will tend to give you a kick up the co coxis. Is that how you say it? Okay. You want to know why I'm giving you this chance? Truth is, as a sworn servant of the Master of Destruction, I'm not supposed to fraternize with your kind. But considering the state of my ship, I've got no other choice. Anyway, it's not like you're a proper builder. You're only an apprentice at the end of the day. So I'm sure it's just fine. You wouldn't forsake me for this little thing. For a little thing like this, right? Anyway, I think you've chewed the fat long enough. If you want to cling on to your life for a little longer, I suggest you continue working like the dutiful little builder you are. Just remember that you can get all sorts of useful material by smashing things up. Just be careful that you don't, uh, that what you bash don't bash you back. Okay. Uh, menu. Uh, Say, um, excuse me, but I guess I can't save right now because it's not letting me. You're in Ottawa, and since the moment I let you out of that cell, you've been scurrying around my deck, chatting with my crew without a care in the world. If anything, I'd wager you were actually enjoying this. There must be something wrong with you. I can't explain it any other way. I mean, why else would you wear that dopey grin on your dopey mush? Faced with the, faced with the same fate, most prisoner, prisoners would be scared witless, but not you. You what? You always look like that when someone's got a job for you? Hmm, it seems like you aren't scared of us at all. Better keep you busy, or who knows what you might try and pull. Luckily, there's plenty for you to be uh, getting on with. For starters, some of the boys on the deck have got jobs that need be need doing. Report back to me when you've sorted them out. Oh, can I save? Please. Please let me save. Please. Please, let me save. No. I don't know what's been saved. Oh. I want to play Diablo 2. Shoot. I've been watching you, Builder. I saw you scrabble around the deck, really pocketing all the wood you could find. The raging tempest that struck last night washed our all of our navigation lights overboard, but such things can be rebuilt, can they not? To wit, I wish for you to use the wood you collect to make some new torches. You see that worn out workbench right there? Use it to make the five torches. Here, I'll I believe you'll need this oil to craft them. How nice of them. Once you have the torches, you must put them back in their proper positions. Uh, the five blocks will be your sign, sign there. There is one by the workbench and four more around the stairs that lead below the decks. Place one torch upon each block. I cannot take any of these monsters seriously like ever. Do not fail, fail me, builder. Craft the five torches and put them in place. Return to me when you have finished the task. Uh, work. Use a worn out workbench. Um, let's see. Craft five. Ten. Okay. So I just need one. 
One splat. Uh, torches can be put, placed on top of other blocks. Select uh, the item with the control and press X to put one down. Okay. There we go. It seems you have done exactly as I asked. The guiding flame burns brightly as before. For a ship such as ours, they could do with being a touch more sinister, if I do say so myself, but I shan't complain. The deck is illuminated once more. I must say, your propensity to create unsettles me. Not that it matters. You will soon outlive your usefulness. But your work is not over yet. There are others aboard this ship who might still find some use for you. Go talk to them, I pray. Uh, complete. Okay. Three of the mon other monsters on board have got- oh, okay. Understand them all. Okay, what you need. Well, if it isn't the so called builder, anyone think you own the place the way you're strutting? Yeah, yeah. What's with the attitude? You're running errands for the boys on the captain's orders, and you want to get me to give you a job to do? Tell you what, you can help me uh, relieve the board of being stuck on this good for nothing ship as long as you're not afraid to put the life on your line. Truth is, I've always wondered whether builders can fight. How do you feel about going uh, mano a mano with a monster? Sure. Oh, you fancy taking a swing at this kid? Just, just try not to kill her, eh? Kick, kick, kick. Okay. All right, better put them dukes up. I warn you, though, this skeleton soldier's a proper head case. Come and fight me another after the fight's finished if you can still walk. Okay. Good enough. I can kinda. Well, you're a better boxer than you look, I'll give you that. Still, the only thing those pathetic pu uh, punches of <laughs> yours hurt was my pride. Not that I should be surprised. You're pretty bony for someone who claims to be a builder. That doesn't exactly bode well for your future career, does it? Lucky you don't have a future to speak of at all. Kek, <laughs> kek, All right. Be off with you. Go and tell the bo bosun what a weakling you are. Kehehe, <laughs> you fight like a cow's cadaver. You, your builders really aren't cut out for combat after all. What's that? You would have smashed into smithereens if you had a weapon? Kehehe, <laughs> I like this story. You're going to bash him up the school with one of them torches you're... You're such a whiz at whipping up. Don't make me laugh. Huh, what's that book you've got there? A new recipe. Cypher stick, a broken branch whittled to work as a weapon. It works. Don't just stand there smirking. Tell me what's so funny. You what? You just worked out how to make a cypher stick? Well, I never. Are you going to tell me that builders can invent things as well as make them? Well, just don't, don't just stand there, uh, or don't just stand there looking around, looking garbless. Put your money where your mouth is and make a cypress stick, then you know where the work, yeah. 
And one more thing, once you've made it, don't forget to equip it. A weapon's no good otherwise. Select and then X to wield it. Try equipping the cypher stick to deal some extra damage. Okay. There you go, sir. The girl genius returns, cypher stick in hand. Now you really look the part. What do you say? Fancy another crack at that old bag of bones? Now you got a weapon? Sure. Okay, hey, that's the spirit. I want to watch that rotter try and put himself back together once you're done with him. Does he hate that guy? Uh, compound fracture. A bone crushing defeat. I don't know if I can pick myself up to, after this one. Go on then. Then last, go and brag about beating me to the book, son. Okay. I really want, just want to pick up his sword, but okay. Well, you certainly gave that bag of bones a good hiding. Just look at that state of him. The only thing he's good for now is feeding a dog. I don't think a dog would even want to. You what? You feel a bit sorry for him? Kehehehe, <laughs> that's a new one. I'll wager no human ever shed a tear for a monster before. Just don't think you can butter me up by tickling my funny out bone. Anyway, thanks for that, Builder. It certainly helped pass the time, if nothing else. I think I learned something today. You builders are useless in a fist fight, but with a weapon in hand, you're not to be sneezed at. But you're not done for the day just yet, by the long shot. I've got a feeling my bones, there's someone else on board. Yes, I know. Okay. Oh shoot, I just passed him by. What do you want? My my, you have been a little bit busy little lady, haven't you? Stranger danger. First you make these torches and now a cypress stick. But one can hardly call oneself a builder without tools of the trade. Where are yours, builder? Do you even have any? Sure. Liar, the only thing you're carrying is that cypher stick. You only don't have a single tool upon your person. Well, I think I ought to do something about that. Haven't, haven't. We ought to do about something like about that, hadn't we? I confiscated this pair of gloves from the builder in the brig below deck. Now they're yours. With these equipped, you'll be capable of hoisting up a whole host of objects without the need to smash them first. Ideal for organizing your articles in an orderly fashion. So without further ado, take your brand, your newfound gloves, gather up all the baler, barrel strewn, higgledy piggledy about the deck, and place them in the map beside me. Okay. Pick some stuff and plunk it down. Um, press the ZR tool to pick it up or put it down. Press or ZR. Yeah, I, I said ZR. Did I say ZL? I can't read. I'm using. I'm. I'm looking at at it from like the uh, OBS. Hmm for my laptop and it's just an itty bitty screen. Uh, press Y while holding something to rotate it. I can't, I can run. Okay, I'm trying to place it right there. A bit finicky. K 
Okay, two more barrels. not quite count. There we go. Wonderful work. Six perfectly positioned barrels. I'm sure sure you'll agree that a pair of gloves is an indispensable tool for any budding builder. I was under the impression that the youth of today were nothing but a swarm of work shy wastrels. But based on your showing just now I may have uh, to reassess my stance. Alas, no matter the blood, sweat, and tears you shed in servitude, you'll always be a builder, the eternal enemy of our exalted order. I fear your time among us will be, will be but short, but your fate is not for me to decide. That is the captain's responsibility. Okay. It would appear that you have attended everyone's errands for now. Hurry along and inform the good captain that you require some more back-breaking chores. Okay, can you tell me how to save? Not bad, not bad. Looks like you've done everything the lads asked of you. Nice to see a human working your fingers to the bone for us monsters and without a word of complaint neither. If I doubted it before, I'm certain now you would actually like this sort of thing. You're a proper weirdo, you know that? Still, I won't be satisfied until I hear from the horse's mouth. So to speak, do you enjoy the building things? I would assume so. <laughs> of course you do. It's why you, what gets you out of bed in the mornings. I can tell from the look in your fleshy face. You've got the makings of a master crafter, and that's what we can't let you. Why we can't let you live? I will take y'all on. Well, what? What with your builders being our mortar enemies, enemies or anything and everything, I can't exactly have you running Bodister and building a building like a uh, bilio now, can I? I'm sorry to say, kid, but I'm gonna have to sever that smalling skull from your shoulders right now. Okay, hey, just tickling your ribs. Don't be so scared. I'm not gonna really lop your noggin off. Well, as long as you stay on my good side, that is. After all, I wouldn't want to lose a willing worker like you. I reckon you've got what it takes to be a cracking little cabin girl. And that's what's more, I like the cut of your jib. What do you say, Lassie? Will you join my, join my skeleton crew? You don't have to say anything. I can tell... <laughs> I can tell you're too overcome with joy to thank me now. Actually, there's something else I've been meaning to ask you. I cannot breathe. What's that big book you're lugging around? I've never seen anything like it before. Oh. Oh, where'd this rain come from? Wow, you'll have to tell me later, lassie. Looks like there's another storm rolling in. An apprentice build builder, you will do nicely. Uh-oh. Uh, this is your world to create and yours to destroy. Oh, so I'm a god now. Now come to me, my child. Oi, cloth ears, what are you gawking at? Didn't you hear me? I told you to get your fleshy rump below deck into the hold. It's far too dangerous up here in the l for a landlubber like you. Okay. Ooh, that's an awful storm. I've never seen the ship shake and shutter, sh shutter show. Sha sha sha. If you're looking to hide in the hold, it's just at the end of this corridor. Hurry, builder, or this uh, chat might might just be a last. Just a skeleton. Bill 
builder, builder, though, though the storm may set your spine a tingle, you need not fear. Our captain's the finest sailor of the children of the Hargon will, has ever had. The ship, ship will be safe with him at the helm. Follow his orders and live to see another or day. But if you rock the boat, well, let's just say you can, I hope you can swim. Oh, it's locked. What in the world is happening out there? Oh, we're doomed, I say. What a way to go. This is where I thought things couldn't get any worse. The mother will start storm strikes. My luck runs uh, dry as soon as I'm about to get s as I'm about to get soaked. Great. You builder, now it's not the time to be rubbing your freedom in our faces. Put a stop to all this. This shaking out be very cross. Okay. Woo! What in the heck's going on? Huh. C -c Captain Snurp! Come to the hold quickly, we're in a deep goo goo down here. Blimey, I don't like the sounds of this. Hold on tight, I'm on my way. You alright there, Builder? Ah, but what? If I can't be stopped and help some human, I've got to get to the hold. Hargon, preserve us. This is bad. This is really bad. Hey, Builder, get your bony backside in here pronto. I need your help. Okay, we got a leak. Over here, builder. Ridiculous alignment. Sir, I just took me two seconds. I've got a uh, bad news, builder. We've been swept right into a reef and our rock's gone clean through the hole. If we don't fix this fast, we will be heading down to Davy Jones' locker. I don't know if this will work. Try cramming a crate into the holes. You got a pair of gloves, don't you? So use them. Oops, sorry. Uh, wrong bit. That was a closer shave than I'd have liked, but you did it. You you saved my. I'll throw me a bone, not more holes. Wow, we're taking on more water. You've got to do something. Use some more crates to plug up these holes. Okay. There's one. Okay, the barrel. Jump. There we go. You're a lifesaver builder. Lifesaver builder? No, I owe you. <clears throat> but our running with that rock has made mincemeat of my home. The next wave that hits us could. Well, I knew it. It's a race against time builder. Cram some more crates. Okay, this one. And then this one. Then running out of crates. Whoops. Whoops. There we go. <clears throat> I'm running out of voice. Um. You shored up my ship, good and proper builder. I don't know where we'd be without you dead. She'll hold out for now, but who's who knows how long... Stop. Just stop. Sh shut up. Oh, throw me a bone. We're done. Holy moly, look at that one. We don't have any crates big enough to plug a hole that size. This is it, Builder. It's nice knowing you. Don't forget me, Builder. I like that skeleton. Oh, cutscene.
Everybody died. Except me. Ooh, man. <laughs> He's like, I'm not a builder, I'm a destroyer. Nice. Saving, 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 loading, loading. Okay, it's actually loading, just very slow. Um, here we go. KB awakens on a sandy shore. Seems she has washed up on a desert island along with the wreckage of the skeleton's ship. She decides to take a look around to see what she can see. Um, thank goodness I can say. Oh, my gosh. Okay. That has been something. I don't know what, but it was something. I'm sorry, guys. Y'all got a little bit of Pokemon Go in that. Anyways, that has been Dragon Quest Builders 2. I will definitely play more later uh, when I get the time and when I get, like, some water to drink because, ugh. Just a little bit of speaking kills my throat. Anyways, talk to y'all another time. Bye-bye.